Hey everyone, this is Tatiana with Selfish Shades and today is September 22nd. It is a little afternoon and I just received the first package for today. Um, today's package is from Uline. I know I told you guys I had to order smaller boxes in yesterday's video because um, the boxes were a little too big. I'm going to keep the boxes because I can use them for my purses and other products but I just got this box in so let's do an unboxing. Alright, so this is how the package comes. A new line. I know you guys didn't see me unbox the last one. Alright. So these boxes are six by six by two. Like it comes with usually like a pamphlet or a flyer in it. Oh, they're so small and cute. So let me show you guys real quick. So this is how it looks. I only ordered 25 of them. Sorry, the angle is so weird. I don't know where my stand is for this. So I'm trying to make this work. Okay. Let's see. And it still fell. Jeez. Alright. So, um, yesterday I was talking to you guys about the, um, the, uh, oh, I cannot think. I was talking to you guys about the boxes, um, I have not received from Amazon. I got a notification that those are supposed to supposedly be shipping so we will see oh my gosh it's so freaking cute and small all right let's see okay so this is how the box looks put together as you can see it's a lot smaller than the other box i originally purchased it's like so cute. But I think this is going to be perfect for the collection. Or the um, Peace Out of Scorpion box. So, that's awesome. I haven't put any stuffing in it, but you can see. So, two pair of glasses, a lip gloss, the She Bad and She Know It keychain, um, a bracelet, and a compact mirror is going to be what's in here. And I feel like that's going to fit perfectly in this box so I'm excited about this let me see how it looks with some stuffing okay so just absolutely adorable it's gonna be little to no movement yeah it's gonna be little to no movement once all the items get in here of course it's gonna have its plastic covering on it and its um, sunglass case but it's so cute so I will be ordering more of these boxes. Like I said, I'm going to make a total of 150 to 200 boxes of the um, the Savage Scorpion box, the bundle box. I'll be making about 200 of those. Um, my goal is to have the boxes itself with the stuffing in it already put together and ready uh, to go by at the latest, like October 28th or something. Um but you guys will see that process as well. I have a, a nice size storage room, um, like a storage closet in my apartment. So I'm pretty much just going to line the top of it. They're really small, so um, it shouldn't be too hard to put them together and line the top um, shelf of my boxes. Because when orders are being placed, I want to have a smooth transition and just be able to get it out. Uh, once I have my products, I'm going to go ahead and put the products in the box and seal it. And um, that way, when an order comes in, I can just grab a box, um, throw a label on it, and get it shipped out as soon as possible. Because you always want to have the faster the shipping, the quicker the um, customer is able to get their product. 
the better they'll feel. Hopefully more positive reviews. You know, you just got to think long term, like longevity. And I want my brand and my business to have a really good, when someone says selfish shades, they like, oh yeah, that's a good store. You know, shop there. They come quick. Products are always nice. You know, stuff like that. So I'm waiting on a few more boxes, as I was saying. Amazon has confirmed shipment today. Um, not like shipment from the warehouse, but shipment like it's on its way out for delivery today. I cannot wait to do that unboxing for you guys. It's some of um, the products I purchased for the press one nails. So, y'all, I'm just eager. Like when I tell you I want to have quantity, I mean I want to have quantity, quality and quantity. That's what I'm working toward. Having enough products to where my store is beneficial and its earning potential is good. But also the quality of the product people want to return. So that's what I'm aiming for, y'all. Yeah. So super excited. Ooh, early. Early UPS came through. I'm going to place another order this week for um, more of these boxes. And I will... Let you guys know how it's going. I'm going to put together these 25 boxes because that's how excited I am, okay? You know I am. Hey, everyone. So, I am back checking in. I just received my package. It is 4.36 p.m. And it was a little bit of a runaround from the post office. I'm not even going to get into it. I'm super excited to show you guys what I got in my package. Alrighty. Let's see. My scissors are not cutting today. While I'm out, oh my gosh, I'm just super excited about this. So, if you guys remember me telling you this was for my um, press on nails, and I have I have purchased some Model Ones nail polish, the gel nail polish. I want the nails to be really firm and um. Yeah, I want them to be really firm and last a good while. You know, also without damaging the nail. Because I got my nails done, you guys, and I love the design of them. I had them done. Um, I love the design of them, but one, they did not last long. Usually they do, though. They didn't. And two, when it came off, I don't know if you can... It doesn't even matter. Like, half of my nail was really lifted. It was horrible. So, I bought these pretty colors from Model 1. I'm trying to lean it up with the... <laughs> really pretty. I can't wait to show you guys the designs of the nails. So, we have... Uh, ice bar, strawberry ice cream, cream... Um... Bloomin', Dancing With Me, Poetry, and First Love right here. So that is that. I also purchased, of course, I have a lot of these already, but I do not have an organizer like that. Also, this should be the one that came with the gold flakes. The oil, I meant the foils. I think it was, I'm not sure. I have to take a look at it, but I love that. It comes with a little thing to pick it up. Some of these, I don't know, make sure you guys can see that. Yeah, I was really frustrated. Like, I'm not going to get into the story. You know what? Yeah, I will. So, I had my mom's boyfriend go down and check my mailbox for me because it said it was delivered. And he came back and was like, yeah, they put a key in there, but it doesn't open any of the boxes. So I'm like, I'm about to go to the post office. I go to the um, box to check it one more time. 
It doesn't open anything. So I get up there and I'm talking to the lady at the post office. I'm trying to explain to her. Um, and so y'all, I'm trying to explain to her what happened. And she was like, okay, we can have somebody come back out there tomorrow to fix the mailbox for you. I'm like, no, the package is late. This is the second time. Um, yeah, this is the second time the order was placed. It had to be replaced because the shipment was lost in transit. I was like, it's supposed to be here Friday. I, I really need this today. It's for my business. I cannot. I did, of course, I didn't tell them I got like 56 days to the launch. That's not their business. But I did need them to come up off that package. So, um, the, she was like, let me go talk to my manager. She was really polite. She said, let me go talk to my manager. The manager comes out and was like, something's wrong. And I showed him the key. I said, it doesn't open anything. So he was like, okay, let me grab my keys. I'll meet you at your mailboxes. So I drive back to my apartment. And um, I got there. I knew I was going to get there before him because, of course, he had to get the keys and things. So I get out the car and I um, get to unlock them boxes, y'all. I'm trying to get, <laughs> trying to find my box. Um, it said it was supposed to be for a bigger box, one, like a one P, but it was the smaller boxes are two P's and I hadn't checked any of them. So I start where my box is and I just checking the two P's and checking them. And finally one opens. I'm like, Oh yes, you know, wonderful. But dang, he's going to have to come out here. Girl, open the box and there's a key in it. Y'all, I opened the box and it was a key in it, a key to the one P. So I opened that box and there's nothing there. As I'm doing this, I'm getting pissed off now. I'm using the key to open all the damn boxes. I'm trying to at least. It's not working. The guy from the post office comes, the manager, and he gets opening, like with his master key, opening the boxes. And we open like four boxes before, like four mailbox slots, you know what I mean? Before um, he sees my package. And where my mailbox is, let's just, let me just put it in perspective. My mailbox is, let's say, Y, and the letter was for like an H. Like, that's how far away they had the wrong box. They had the wrong key in the mailbox for me to get my package. So, he made it right. I appreciate him coming to do that because, you know, of course, they're, they're trying to make it wait. Um, hopefully, I can get nobody in trouble, but it is what it is at this point. But sorry for that, you know, abrupt story. <laughs> Let me finish that. Okay. So, I've been really wanting these for a while. I went ahead and grabbed me a four pack. I'll probably buy another one. But uh, this is for, you know, for you to put your nails on. You can put them on these to do the, uh, put it on this to do the nail art. That way you're not like holding it, get your finger all messed up. So, here's that. And. That's weird. Oh, okay. Well, so they put this in there with the nail. So I bought this package. This is mostly for me because I like wearing nails, but I don't like them super duper long. What? Y'all saw that right? Something just blew out. Okay, so. This is called the edge cutter. It pretty much can cut anything it says it can cut. It's open. Y'all, they about to get a whooping up in here, bruh. My package is open. That is so fucking frustrating to me. Shit. Is it new? Oh, God. Like, I'm going to be really upset if I have to send this back. And it's got little stains on the back of it. <clears throat> okay, so here's that. Um, What else we got here? So I bought some coffin nails. Here's like a sculpting thing. I'm not really going to need this unless I'm doing it on myself or one of my friends, you know, directly. I thought I felt a nail. This is open. When I tell you that there's some shady shit happening right now i mean it like there is no reason why my nails should be open like
Even this is all scuffed. These people are fucking retarded. Now I'm pissed off. Oh, God. I might have to request a refund. Like I told you guys before, I paid um almost, yeah. I don't know if you can see those scuffs. I don't know. The computer's kind of glaring off of it, but <sighs> that's so disappointing. Okay. Um, and here they included this. Now I'm checking to see if it's used. I really am. Um, yeah. So. Um, I have one more item. Sorry, guys. I'm, like, frustrated. Like, you know you would be frustrated, too, if you wait for all these items and they come here and they're fucking open. And, oh, I don't mean to be cussing like this, y'all, but my nerves. Okay. If my box is open, I'm about to slap somebody for reals. All right, so I bought this nail dryer. This doesn't have a... It doesn't have one of those little plastic flaps on it. I'm saying it hasn't been open. I just don't understand. Like what they do. Take it out, do their nails, and put it back. <sighs> this don't even come with a fun. I need to write you guys, so I'm hoping. Oh my god. There's no plastic on I got a used item. There's no plastic on any of this. You know how usually stuff like this will have plastic on it. Instead it has scratch marks on it. Like I'm sure that's a piece of hair right there. I'm really disappointed in this shipment that I've just waited five days to get. At any rate, so here we go. Life of an entrepreneur because sometimes, and this is even with vendors, the pictures will look fantastic and wonderful, but you get it and you like, wait, what? What was that? Said it was new. It's definitely not. Like, I wish I could show you guys. I don't know if you can see the scratches on this. Will scratches affect the, pro the the quality of how well it heats and dries? Nope. But did I pay for it? Hell to the yeah. And I wanted it new. It said it was new. So, mm, that pisses me off. At any rate, this is the last box for today. I will be getting another package from Amazon Thursday. And then my first shipment of the money clutch purses are supposed to arrive on uh friday so i'm super excited about that as far as the other two packages from alibaba the other two orders i have not seen um an update i'm probably gonna get with the vendor on a lip gloss probably tonight i'll probably have to wait up tonight to do that um and then the other the sunglasses she did reach out to me i didn't reach out to her she reached out to me and let me know that they'll be shipping it again i know i told you guys this this morning but they will be shipping it and i see the shipment has started but it has not been picked up yet so i don't know what's worse i get notified the shipment has started or not being notified that anything has happened i don't know because it's just sitting there so um yep there's that. You're going to have some really good moments. You're going to have some really dry moments. You're going to be super excited. And you're going to be super pissed off. It's the life of an entrepreneur. It may not be for you. But um, I will check in with you guys later on tonight.
Hey everyone, so if you made it to the end of this video, kudos to you. I'm sorry it was so long. Um, as you've seen in the, in the video clip before this, um, oh, no. I did go ahead and... <laughs> I did go ahead and um, try, I created one pair of the press on nails for myself to see if there's anything you know I need to critique these nails came in a clear container as you saw earlier but it wasn't very organized I'm probably still going to have to go through and put them in little um, Ziploc bags because the container itself won't close um, but I've been wearing them so far you know all night and it hasn't been hasn't been too bad also y'all can we talk about this Soak wrap for a moment, like I don't know. I'm just loving it. So, at any rate, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate you tuning into my channel, <laughs> and um, be sure to like and subscribe if you're not already a subscriber. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up. If you would like your next coffee on me, be, be sure to drop those cash app names. Um, and all you have to do to win a coffee on me is be a subscriber, like this video, and uh, comment that cash app name below. At any rate, thank you for watching, and I will see you guys tomorrow.